We got hair in my face. Okay, it's fine. It, it is what it is. We're just gonna have to deal with it for about five minutes. Oh, hi everyone. Welcome back for some good vibes in video games. And Toby Wan Kenobi, aka Toby Hawk with his mohawk. Look at him. I can't even take credit for that joke. Someone on Twitter said it and I thought it was hilarious. So I'm borrowing it. But shout out to you. Much to his dismay, I'm about to jump back into Red Dead Redemption and have some more fun. Yes, I am. But don't worry, buddy. You will be in my thoughts forever and ever. You such a good boy. My little mama's boy. All right, dude, though, seriously, you are getting so heavy. Getting some gains in today. Seriously, though, like... Anyway, like I said before, we are going to jump back into Red Dead Redemption. Last episode was amazing. It was just one of the best I've recorded. The whole time I was having so much fun. I got some incredibly amazing news right before sitting down and recording that episode. And I'm actually recording this one in the same day because when you're feeling good, you're feeling good and you might as well just run with it. Thank you guys so much for clicking on the video today. I really hope you enjoy it as always. And let's just jump in. Oh, and I also do want to say before we jump in that, you know, being on social media and on the on the internet all the time, it, it, it really is a full-time job sometimes to stay so completely self-aware in the moment. And I'm, and I'm talking about me specifically and like my perspective and how I really deal with day-to-day -day things and like online trolls and negative news and like all that stuff. But I am fully aware out there that there are probably some people watching these videos that are really struggling right now. Your struggle is so valid. We've all gone through things everyone is going through something or has gone through something or is currently gone going through something right now and i'm not going to sit here and give you advice because advice is not like a one size fits all thing everyone is so different everyone deals with issues and stuff their own way but really all i can do is just maybe help you find solace in the fact that it gets better sometimes you just have to be extremely patient and listen to your body if there's one thing that you know having worked in like health and wellness and you know stuff like that if, if there's anything that that field has taught me is that listen to your body if you're not feeling it you're not feeling it it's okay to feel your emotions it's okay to take a day off it's okay to take a break from anything even video games Video games, at the end of the day, are meant to be fun. They are not meant to feel like a chore. They are not meant to burn you out. I'm a firm believer that the second you start to feel any sort of burnout, lack of motivation, or anything like that, that is your bodily, physiological sign, mental signs, like if you're dealing with depression or anxiety. I do believe that that is our body's way of telling us that it is time to take a break. It is okay to do things for yourself. It is okay to put yourself first and retreat from society maybe for a little bit. If that's what you need to do, that's what you need to do. But you need to listen to yourself. You need to listen to your body. If you don't have your health, you have nothing. And I don't know why I decided to say this. I think I might have seen something on Twitter that sparked this, but it just made me think about this. And it's not just you. You're not the only one struggling. Sometimes life is hard. That's, that's the facts. I'm not saying you need to be positive, happy, shiny, you know, butterflies, rainbows. Life isn't like that all the time. I never want to come off like that ever because I am f I am painfully aware of life struggles and I've been through them. I've been through them recently. I've been through them months ago. Like I, I kind of go through them here and there. Everything ebbs and flows. There are certain things that happen to me that I don't disclose on the internet because it's private. We all have struggles. But what I firmly believe is in every situation, you can spin the perspective to at least be optimistic and to just understand that if you're patient enough and if you're not super quick to react negatively and you can kind of reframe your mindset, that it can be a lot easier to deal with instead of just getting angry and getting reactive and blowing up in someone's face. Obviously, it is so much easier said than done, but things can get better if you allow them to get better, if you give yourself the space and the time to not fall into the anger trap, but take care of yourself, that is the most important thing. And it's not selfish to do that. This is a saying for a reason, and it's one of my favorite sayings, but I tell myself all the time, you cannot pour from an empty cup. Sorry for the extremely long spiel. <laughs> 
<laughs> we are now 10 minutes into the video, but I just feel like that needed to be said, and I hope you can get something from that. Anyway, oh, that's right, I'm currently in the middle of being a terrible person on accident, and I think- Oh no! Someone picked a fight with me at the end of last episode! Okay, never mind, I'm not sorry about it. If you can't take it, don't dish it, you know what I'm saying? Oh! What is wrong with me? Legolas does not agree. Ooh! And we happen to just run into another stranger mission. How do you do, partner? Okay. Cool. I have a bounty on me, but ignore that. What you searching for, partner? Flowers. I've been gathering some flowers for my wife. She's waiting for me back in the cabin. That's very sweet of you. And yeah, we've been together 50 years now, me and my darling Annabelle. Aw, She always cool. loves these, these wild fever few that uh, grow around this place. You know. But she's, she's getting on now in years. And she, Such is life. To get up and about. Mm -hmm. So I, I want to I wanna bring her a lovely bouquet for our anniversary. Well, I've seen quite a few flowers in my travels, if you'd like to help. I think well, I have some. Yeah. Listen, these old fingers ain't what they used to be. Yeah, I'd love it. Sure, bring me, bring me any pretty ones you find, huh? Okay. Gather three wild fever, fe fever few, three red sage, three desert sage for Billy. Oh, snap. Okay, so... I don't see anything marked on the map, so I think this is just like a passive quest where I can pick it up as I go along and do other chores. I think I'm gonna do that. All right, I'm back here to, first off, pay off my bounty, or I think I still have a pardon letter left. Yeah. So I'm cheap, I don't wanna spend $40, so I'm gonna use it. Maybe I could use it on a larger bounty if I ever accrue one, but that's not generally the goal. <laughs> I'm gonna try to save myself some money. Pay off all bounties, give pardon letter. Will this clear my name? One count of murder? At least I, the laws, eyes. I wouldn't go that far. He did in fact start it. So, sure. Did he come at me with fists? And did I pull a knife out on him and stab him? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. But like, self-defense? Self-defense? You ever heard of it? Cause that's what I did. I can take you all over. It was all in self-defense. And no thank you, sir. Again, I am so cheap. I am not going to pay for a carriage ride when I can teleport for free 99. And uh, I don't feel like doing any nighttime chores right now. So let's just see if I can talk to Bonnie. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> that little sandbar. I mean. <laughs> Ooh. It's called the burning. Excuse me, Mr. Marston. Have you seen my father anywhere? No. He went out this morning to ride the land and was supposed to be back hours ago. I don't know. The ranch hands have been out looking, but so far they've found nothing. Well, come on. Let's go look for him. Okay. Let's head well, out. He couldn't have gotten far. I don't have a good feeling about this one. Come on, Legolas. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go find oh, you, Daddy. How feeling about this? Yeah. It's not like him to be away for so long. Don't worry. We'll find him. He's not as young as he used to be. What if he's hurt himself? Your father can still handle himself just fine, Miss McFarland. He's built like an oak. You're probably right. But I can't help worrying. He's all I've got. Come on, boy. He's built like an oak. Thank you. Don't you have any brothers or sisters, Miss McFarland? I had six brothers, but five of them died, either from sickness or foolish choices. And the other one? He left for the east and never came back. Uh -huh. Must be getting on for ten years ago now. He's a high and mighty banker in New York, according to his last letter. He should be here, helping you and your pa. I don't want his help. He can live his life any way he wants. True. When I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe, I fear a little for his soul. <laughs> he switched his saddle for a tie, and that's fine. I just never met a man in a tie I could trust. Yeah, ooh, okay. Huh. Yeah. I Greed is the soul someone. killer. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, I, I would leave too if the family track record and mortality rate Come isn't on. so high. Daddy! What happened? Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. Maybe the baller twins, that bunch. 
Now you head back to the ranch right now and fetch the wagon. Yes, sir. Marston, you watch after her. Okay. I'll do that, sir. Please stay close. Watch out! Yeah. What could have happened to those poor men? And their horses were dead, too. A cougar? Panther? Mountain lion? It's a bad idea to split up right now. Uh, I think we yeah. get back there as soon as we can. Who could have done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. I'm just glad the dad's okay. Those damn rustlers! I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's Basin myself. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men have you killed? A lot. Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality to what you did. We all have a code. Oh my god! The barn's on fire! Oh no. Well, we weren't all bad. Like someone we know. Whoa there! <laughs> Crazy. This ain't working! The doors are blocked! We need to find another Let's way in! Try and get in through the loft, Mr. Marshall! Get up the windmill! Okay. Well, we're not going up that ladder. Somebody get them horses out. It's the proper way to go. Yeah. Okay. Go. John. No. Oh, you're kidding me. All right. Second time's the charm. There we go. <laughs> Yikes. I'm just afraid of running off. Okay. Let's go. Our, oh, oh, oh. Oh, we're adding a little parkour. You have more upper body strength than I do. Or will ever have. We should just slid down. Yeah, here we go. Yeah! Alright, open the barn doors. He got the door open! <coughs> go, go, go! No! Save him! Go! Giddy up! Go butt tap all of them. Go. Oh, our epic fire barn door moment. Ah! Oh, I oh. Hmm. Hmm. Not as cool as I was hoping, but. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm just glad they're okay. You sure know how to handle yourself. Thanks, Marston. Yes, John, thanks. You, well, you saved the ranch. If you'll excuse me, I, I've got chores to attend to. Hey, w w hold on a second over there. Sincerely, John. Thank you. Well, did all I could, Miss McFarland. Sorry about all the damage. We all are alive. I really want you out of here. Yeah, well, my father fought Indians. I scarcely think we're going to be frightened by some white trash. <laughs> white trash can be pretty frightening. Well, they don't <laughs> frighten me. Good. John, my family owes you a great debt. I think you got enough debt. You saved my life. All I ask of you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people I know. Oh. Uh... Of course, Mr. Marston. It'd be my pleasure. I love him so much. Well, you get some rest. I've got to go see how my father's bearing up. God, I love John so much.
maybe he does bad things sometimes, but can we can we kind of agree that he does them for the right reasons? For the people that he loves? I cry just thinking about him. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know my own strength. Ooh, I have a hankering for some horseshoe. Uh -huh. Well, guess who's not playing horseshoe with me? Bad boys don't get to play- Excuse the hell out of me. I don't- I don't care for backs, ass, and cows. Okay. I don't know what got your panties in a twist, but I won't have this. I will not have this. You! 1v1 me. Let's freaking go now. Let's do- oh! No, no, no. Yeah, ch co come at me. Come at me. Ah! Well, I am egging it on. Alright. Oh, jeez! I don't know what I did. I don't know who I pissed off. I don't know what I did. You just, oh, this is, just, is this from killing that guy last episode? I, dude, I'm sorry. He came at me first. It was, it was me or him. It was kill or be killed. Jeez, oh, I'm gonna go play some horseshoe now. Oh my god. Bonnie, please fucking save me. You have some crazy ass cow on the loose. Yeah, we just needed to sleep that off. I don't know what was happening. You know, maybe, maybe myself and the cow just needed. Some time to sleep, sleep it off, you know, get over it, get over whatever was, <laughs> whatever was happening. The somebody crapped in that cow's cornflakes. And I want to play some horseshoe now, because <laughs> I am so addicted to this game. Play a game of horseshoe? Yes, I do. And I wonder if the larger the bet, if like the better my opponent is. I want to do 10. You might think this is crazy, but... I like to live dangerously. All right, let's go. Ten doll hairs. Skip. Don't care. I just want to play. This is my happy place now. Oh, okay, forgot how to do it for a sec. Let's go on the sand. I seen grandma throw back. Shut your damn mouth. Oh, I keep pressing, I keep pressing X instead of RT to throw it. Hold up. Ah, not good. That was a warm up round. Also, where the heck? How did he get one point already? Well, that's not fair. I don't know where he got. Oh, oh, one point per horseshoe. Duh. Skip. Oh yeah, we all know this guy's really good. Okay, jeez. Yeah, look, what the hell? Alright, well, now I know. Don't bet high unless I'm super confident. Oh, let's go oh. suck it! Getting bad? I'm pretty sure I beat you. Or is that not close? Get perfection! I hit it! Mother trucker. What? But mine is literally on top of his. They don't make no sense. We all know he's gonna do well. Like, how close is he gonna get? He basically got it. He basically freaking got it. Look at that. How do you even come back from that? I'm not that good yet. Okay. Oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Play horseshoes, they said. It'd be fun, they said. Who said this? Who? Whose great idea was this, guys? Fudge. Uh, God. I'm just too strong for this game. Been wrestling too many cows. Mess up. Mess up. Ugh. Scare you. What the hell? I'm done. I quit. Gus! 
You're killing me, Smalls. Skippy long stockings. I don't want to see this. I told you. This is why... I, and I think I... Th I think I said last time I played this that I was retiring. <laughs> like I was never gonna play this again. And now I regret playing this again. <laughs> I was right. I should have just stopped. I should have retired after the greatest comeback in horseshoe history. But no, no. Why? Well, I don't listen. I don't actually do what I say I'm gonna do. Somebody buy me a drink. No. You have stolen my dignity. Isn't that enough? You throw some horseshoes? No, never again. Nope. Now I'm retiring. Absolutely depressing. Ooh, this is a new area. It's very swampy. I wonder if we'll see yeah. alligators. Wait a second. Fuck! What the no. no! Oh, I panicked. Oh, I panicked. Oh my god, I panicked. Our first cougar. Back off, Vulture, it's mine. Let's make this quick. Yes, please. <laughs> you horse, where are you going? Don't be leaving me here by myself. Uh uh. You just saw me kill a large cat. Hmm, where is this? Oh, <gasps> thieves landing! Oh, yes! Finally! Oh, wow. Where do I even start? Let's hitch. Let's hitch Legolas up to something. Is there a hitching post around here? I think I saw one over here. Ooh. There we go. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Let's buy a newspaper. I want to see what's going on. Watch yourself there. Excuse me? Who's cheating? Not me. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So what I'm going to do, I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'll kind of just hold it here. In case you want to pause and like read for yourself, I don't know. Okay, on to the next one. More trouble in Mexico. All right, and then we got Miracle of the Movies in New Austin. Federal government denies expansion. Merchant run out of town, and then above it is the racing uncertainty. Ranchers struggle with changing economy. Damsels causing distress in moving picture show. <laughs> Lucky children growing up in factories. What? That is problematic. How long will you live? None of us really know. If we knew, there would be no point. <laughs> Wild West show heads east, and then Miss Miscellany. I'm assuming that means like miscellaneous. Yeah, okay. So I don't know if you guys wanted to pause at all during all that to read it yourself. There you go. I hope you enjoyed that, because I will be doing the same. <laughs> Let's go. <gasps> what in the Sam hell? What the f Like, honestly, I just got here. We need to take some medicine. Do I got any medicine? Oh my god. I only have an apple. Well, that will that would have to heal me, right? Because otherwise, moonshine, I don't know if that's going to help us. Only be used on horseback. Oh, is it for a horse? What the heck? Excuse me, sir, are you gonna finish the job? I have no idea what's happening. None. No idea. What? I'm just getting shot at. There is- there was an attempt on my life. Where are the cops? Will it ever stop raining? Will it ever stop raining? I think I got bigger issues here. Well, this place is deadly. I love it. I don't, honestly, I don't even know. I don't even know what's happening. What the heck is happening? 
Oh my god, and I can't even find a place to freaking not die? I don't know. Oh my god. That's what I'm saying! You took the words right out my mouth. And now I just gotta protect myself? I have no idea what's happening. Will you help me? What a warm welcome. There I was, just minding my own business, reading the gosh darn local newspaper. And there were several attempts on my life. And then one succeeded! Let's go! I mean, I knew Thieves Landing was that kind of place, but I didn't- I literally didn't do anything. I am back and I am pissed off. I don't want any funny business. Is this gonna happen again? <gasps> I wanna play Liar's Dice! Oh my gosh, yes! So, yeah, what the heck, guys? Now y'all seem peaceful? Wait, should I do the side mission? Oh, did- no. Did you see this decor? Oh, that's what they do to cheaters around here. I'm gonna have to keep myself in check. Oh no, I've never played this. I need 200 bucks? This is not gonna go well. Am I really in a part with $200 right now? You know what? With the day I've been having, how this all started off. Why not? Thank you for the constant reminder that I am poor. No to Blackjack. Where is Irish? Where the hell is Irish? Nuns? Oh god. Up, sister. Put them up. Irish, what are you doing? Who the hell are you? Give me that. I'm your old friend Amnesia. <laughs> oh, oh god. Blimey. But I've come to tell you, if you ever pretend to forget my name or your debt to me again, I'll make sure you reach heaven before these two ladies. <laughs> now get down there. <laughs> oh. Oh. Mr. Marston, uh, how are you? Another gold. Ashamed. Ashamed to know you. What the hell's wrong with you, robbing these gentlewomen and ladies of the Lord? I thought they was doxies. Ladies, I'm sorry about this man. He's unfortunately lost his mind to the demon drink. At least I hope he has, and he wasn't this stupid all along. Yeah. So, uh, please excuse us. Bless you. Now, Irish, that Gatling gun doesn't work. I find that rather upsetting, don't you? Oh, heartbreaking. Which is why I was just coming to see you when the drink got the better of me. <laughs> ah. Come on. I know where we can find the parts for you. Ah. Mother fucking Mary. Motherfucking Mary. Too, I already got myself a woman, miss. <laughs> John, I freaking what love you, you so at? much. What, what are you? What are you looking at? Huh? Are you coming or not? Huh? I'm just being a public menace, don't mind me. <laughs> What a lusty specimen you are. Lusty? That fresh air's got me. Oh, he's not, like not talking about me. Not to be good for a fella. Shut up, you lazy drunk. Before I stop your head spinning with a bullet. I resent that, Johnny. I've been working like a beaver on your behalf. <sighs> You've been working like a weasel on my behalf. Bushwhacking defenseless ladies of the cloth? You must have been raised on sour milk, Irish. What are you talking about? I'm a good Catholic boy. You're a booze blind coward. And you're a hypocrite, Marston. You've robbed just as many innocent folks as me. I tried to only rob those who had more than they deserved. Christ, the church has more money than anybody. <laughs> Where are we going, Irish? Easy, friend. Just to see, no response to that. Landing. I'm telling you, Johnny boy, it's our set up. We're meeting this pal of mine at the back door of the office. Hobble-tongued feller by the name of Shaky. 
And he's got the ammunition we need? Jesus, stop fretting, will you? I knows about guns front, back, and sideways. You're gonna be real familiar with mine if things keep on this way. You keep drinking, you're gonna constantly end up sideways. Dude, um, I actually... This is it. I love Come Seth, on, but I think I Irish is my new favorite. He's just so funny. You're always guaranteed a laugh. I'm going back up because I do not trust you. Damn it! That stuttering bastard said this would be open. Oh, well, we'll go around the back. Shaky's probably waiting for us there. Cool, cool. Yep, you lead the way. I'm starting to think you're soft on me, Johnny boy. Can't even sneeze these days without you being there to catch the drip. Ew. This is your last chance, you good-for-nothing shyster. You've already wasted too much of my time. <laughs> I love the names he calls him. You good-for-nothing shyster. Wait up. Keep your eyes open. Shaky's all right, but I don't trust the gang of fools he runs with. To be fair, I don't trust you neither. Oh, God. Shaky's made the arrangements, and he'll... Oh. Oh, shite. Sounds like Shaky's only gone and got himself found out. <laughs> All right. Now all we have to do is find out who you work with. You hear me? Shaky, you wretched fucking son of a whore. Suck my again! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Labor relations don't sound like they're exactly at all time high. Oh my god. You sneak in and get poor Shaky loose. I'll go get the wagon. Good luck, Marston. He's a good man, that Shaky. Okay. All right. What am I gonna do? Go and guns blazing? Let's go get the wagon ready. Alright, then climb the ladders. Oh good. Right. I'm coming, buddy. Hang in there. To avoid detection. Oh, great stealth. Yeah, yeah. The thing that I'm obviously the best at. Hey, you hear that? No. Ah! Come on. Oh. Ah! Oh, this is how we're getting in. Am I supposed to... Oh, God. Holy smokes. Okay. I'm gonna give you Jesse good and hard. I don't know what to do. Where did he come from? Oh my god. I didn't just use up all my ammo. Alright. I'm gonna fill you full of holes! No, me, f you first. Please, please, mister. I'm tired. 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 Okay. Give me one second. I gotta loot their bodies. Oh, yeah. Oh. Thank you for your kindness, Mister. I thought I was dead, man. My kindness is only as good as the bullets you can fetch up for me and your friend Irish. Let me down, and you'll be a dead man. This is gonna be one hell of a fight. Good. All right, let's get out of here. Oh yeah, this is way more fun. Headshot. <laughs> no can do. Where is there's another guy, right? Oh. That, that's it. Introduce this son of bitch to your bubble. Alright, let's go. Puts their hands. Oh, sh 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 Excuse me? Oh, there's only two! Whoa, 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 whoa. This way. Somebody picked it. There we go. 
stay down. I'll take you all on. He's dead. For the door. Follow me. Go on. You open the door. I I'll cover you. Sure. Shit, 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 <laughs> Look out. More of them bastards. Good. Good. I don't like you creeping up behind like that. Ooh, I see you. Come on, partner! Think you can beat me? Yes. Yes, I do. Boom. Well, I want a looty first. There's a bunch more of them out by the by the crates. Ha! Yes. This is right here. This ends. You ain't right now. Right here. Boom. This is a great quest. I'm loving it. Now we're even. Half even, Shaky. You still owe me for them morphine pills to calm your nerves. Sh 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 <laughs> you'll, you'll get your half. More, you d d d dirty f f f f fucking snake. Uh, All right, gentlemen. <laughs> Let's go. Fucking. Fuck. Oh, my virgin ears. My virgin ears? Let's go. I love this game so much. <laughs> My version here. How dare you and Shaky? I killed a lot of men for this damn machine gun of yours. I'm sorry. Oh. Or the dramas. You always miss all the drama. There must be Irish is my favorite. It's it. That's it. Someone's got to drive the wagon, don't they? Teamwork, Johnny boy. That's my game, not just the glory like you. Here we go. I'm ready. No, you know, I'm not gonna use dead eye while trying to fight people on horseback. I hate when it tags the horses. I wish it wouldn't do that. I hope you got money for a funeral. They're not giving up, are they? Yet. Reload. Like this Be hard beating like a bloody drone. Just drive, Irish. You're acting like a schoolgirl. This place you, is Irish, really pretty. That machine gun had better work after all this. Don't you worry. You won't find a finer piece of artillery west of Kobe. Oh no, you do. Reach up ahead. Jesus, we really ruffled a few feathers back there. Seems like half New Austin wants to be dead. Thanks, my boy. Holy smokes. You can take some hits. I don't know if I can take much more of this. They're shooting right at me. Jesus, somebody wants to have you this Yeah, that's what happens when you piss people off in the Wild West. He's not dead. Now he is. <laughs> Hell of a team, me and you. We should consider making this a permanent partnership. Honestly, I, I would do it. Liars in this life, partner. He is hysterical. Well, I no. Think you're ready for part master. You got enough ammunition here to take down a small country, fella. You're <gasps> gonna need it. Bill Williamson's got himself. Oh. Hard. So I guess this is where we part ways, Johnny Marston. Or maybe not, friend. You're gonna be right alongside me when I take on that fort. After all you put me through, it's time you pull the damn trigger for once. Show me what a big, bad killer you really are. Uh, yes, of course. What am I thinking? Don't worry, you can count on me. I just hope I don't steal all your glory. Wouldn't be right or proper. <laughs> Impressive, Marston. We'll have Wes Dickens' wagon rigged and ready to go soon enough. Wow. It's all coming together now. I mean, maybe for other people it was extremely obvious, like, what was kind of happening, what the overall goal was. But for me, it just really 
dawned on me like what exactly our goal was like obviously we know that john wants to find bill williamson for whatever reason for whatever happened and whatever his main motivations are but you know sometimes especially when you have one of these games where there's a lot of different moving pieces and parts and you start to get introduced to all these different characters and they all have these really fun rich backstories when you kind of go out and about in the world and you start doing all of them you do kind of lose at least i this happens to me a lot you do kind of lose sight of maybe what the overall goal is so that's kind of what happened to me i forgot what the main goal was and that was to probably take on Fort Mercer, but now I see why we're meeting all these people and why we're helping everyone out. And we're basically gearing up to, to go fight them. And we have, we need all this artillery. I just, it just didn't dawn on me until now, but yeah, I love this. This is so fun. Ooh, a bounty. Let's see how much the bounty is. Then we got Marshall. I wonder if we get different bounties out here you know, getting it from the McFarlane Ranch over getting one in Armadillo. Okay, let's see how much. Hold, oh. <gasps> Dude, $160 alive? Oh, he's probably gonna be tough though. I mean, even if I do accidentally kill him, 80 bucks is nothing to sneeze at. Let's do, we, we're doing this one. This one's a big, big job right here. Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. Rio de Lobo. Ooh, I like that name. Come on, Legolas, where are you? Come to me, Legolas. That's my horsey. All right, let's go. Ooh, wish me luck. I'm gonna need it. Ooh, another stranger quest. What? And they are everywhere. Good, the more the merrier. Uh, do I know you, sir? About to shove you off this cliff. You better watch what you say. I know. Hello, John. John Marston. Do I know you? I hope so. I seem to know you. You, you do. Yeah. I'm pretty good at remembering faces. Are you? Do you remember Hattie McCourt's face? Who? Who? She was a girl Dutch Vanderlyn shot in the head on that raid on the ferry a few years back. Same one you got shot on. Pretty girl until her eye was hanging out by a thread of tendon and her brain was plastered over a wall. Not really. Oh. <laughs> then why would you remember me, friend? You've forgotten far more important people than me. What's your game, friend? I don't have a game, John. Listen, sometimes I just wish I'd known more about life. I wish I'd had better guidance. A friend of mine is drunk as a skunk in the saloon on Thieves Landing. I think he's gonna be unfaithful to his dear wife. Okay. Why don't you head over there and see if you can advise him how best to proceed? What do you think I am? I know what you are, John. Just if you've got the time, friend. <laughs> well. I'm intrigued by this quest line, so I think I can make time. Woo! What are you waiting for? Okay. Don't tell me you've gone soft in your old age. Excuse me, I am forty something? Are you not the man I thirty something? Late thirties, early forties? I don't know. How old is John Marston? That's a great question. I don't know. Come on! So I wanna say when he was running with the gang and Dutch and everyone, I wanna say he was in his twenties. Like, this would have been, I mean, this would have been years ago as of right now. I don't know. I actually, I don't know the timeline, to be quite honest. But I, I feel like John is probably 30s. It's so interesting, though. But the cool thing about that is I think he referenced a quest from the second game that you do. I remember there being a quest line where you do have to sneak onto a ferry boat to, I think, either get some money or threaten someone. Um, get treasure. I think it was... Dutch wanting to go get some treasure and it went horribly wrong as you could probably assume I feel like we're getting close I was hoping that I come out of this $160 richer where are ya Woo excuse me 
Riley's charge. Oh! What? What the heck do you expect me to do? Oh, I don't want to shoot the, the hostage. Oh my god. Hey! You're well. Yes, I did. I was going to take it anyway. Ah, uh, mine. Oh my, looky what we have here. Come here, horse. Ooh, look at all that ammo. Come on. Feels nice to do something nice. All right, so we're finally here. Oh, I'm super nervous. Super, super, super nervous. I need to find more plants, but there I keep coming across Fever few. This this one. This one. Fever few, fever few. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Anyway. Survival is rank one. Ooh. Alright, hopefully this is a little bit more. Holy no! Are you are you kidding me? Are you flipping kidding me? Oh my god. No, no, no. Oh my god. No! Oh my god. Oh my god, I just walked into a pack of wolves. This is awful. How many of them are there? Oh, oh my god. Ah, I just... Oh, ah! No! <laughs> I don't have a bone to pick with you guys. Sorry, bad joke, bad joke, bad joke. Okay, enough. Enough. Dude, what? Bro, no, 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 leave me in peace, leave me in peace. Look at all these pelts though. <laughs> this will definitely help me rank up my hunter skill, right? I just took out like an entire pack of wolves. Get out of here. Get out of here. Where is say, the person that you work for? Oh my god, I, I, did I actually run out of dead eye? Come on now! Sell back! Oh no, we got it back. Holy smokies. <laughs> oh no, you don't. Oh, easy money. Easy. Get over here. Get yourself in here, man. No, no, no. Yeah, come here. Come here. Come here, come here. You ain't going nowhere. Oh, 160 bucks. Here I come. You're giving me rope burn. You're giving me rope burn. Dude, does this look like a face that cares? Sheesh. You overestimate me. All right, let's get the heck out of here. He is definitely going to be sought after. Get out of here. All right, at least our destination's not too far away. We can do this. Watch it. Please don't roll off. Oh my gosh. Well, we're going to have to play it safe for this because I do not want to lose this target. No! Okay, fun's over. <laughs> I'm now. Yeah, fun's over for you. But we got more people. I wonder if we're gonna be able to get into town if they're gonna disappear before they catch up. Ooh, let's go. Legolas. Quite literally carrying my butt. <laughs> All right. Money time. Lottery. Jackpot. Found that no good piece of dirt. Thanks. Yep. It's so much nicer when they try to escape and you just run out, catch them, lasso them. Makes it so much easier. Look at that. Uh, here you go. You win some, you lose some. But today we're winning. Bounty's alive. Plus one. Oof. All right. What do we want to do next? That was 200 honor worth. Hey. I'm Herbert Moon. I've just been robbed. You got to oh. stop him. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Let me, I'll be right back. How are you? Capture or kill the thief and return the money to the shopkeeper. You know what? 
I'm fearing, I'm feeling merciful today. I think I'm gonna try to just bring everyone in alive. What are you gonna do, sir? I guess I got you now. That's right. <laughs> you will answer for your crimes. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. Carry victim. <laughs> we don't need to call him a victim. This guy is the perpetrator. Don't annoy me. Don't annoy me. Or me. Oh my god, so funny. Come on! Alright, let's go turn you in. Easy. He wasn't even that far away. Easy. Nice! Now he is yours to do with however you please. Carry victim, yeah. Here you go. Do what you want with him. That's the spirit now pay up. country great part. He'll taste some armadillo justice for sure. <laughs> He ain't living to see another day. R.I.P., my friend. <laughs> 28 bucks. Worth it. So worth it. I want to do more treasure hunting. <gasps> oh, I got you. Get away from her. Excuse me. Don't know why you needed to get involved. I won't forget what you did here. Maybe it's time to think about a different line of business. Hey, we're not judging. It's your life. You do whatever you want with it. Just remember that. Don't listen to him. That is the one thing that I disagree. Okay. So, produce that way. <laughs> oh, no, I like meat. Oh, God. Oh, perfect. And Marshall's just right here, too. Let's go. I don't have a clue. All right, but it's gotta be something to do with that government boy. We'll talk to him, find out what he knows. Fucking is. Where is she, Marston? The name of this quest oh, are. You fucking skull. Oh. Where's Bonnie? I don't know. I haven't seen her since after the fire. Why? Why? Because she hadn't been seen since yesterday afternoon. You know, I don't think I can cope. If I lose oh. another child. Now, Drew, nobody's lost anything yet. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, Mr. Marshall! Mr. Marshall! Bill. Come out, come out, wherever you are. I think we know that Bill voice. Brad. Hey, buddy. <laughs> That'd be your next fucking mayor. Even better. Good day, Mr. McFarland. Get out from that horse, boy, or I'll shoot. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend that, mister. No. Not if Drew McFarland wants to see his bony back in one piece. What? Hey, Mr. McFarland. This is a nice girl you got there. <laughs> Get out from there. You know... Part of me's got the thinking I should just marry her myself. Oh, or my dead body. That. What do you want? That's better. No. no. I want Norman Deke. I want him set free. Then you'll get your daughter back, mister. We don't do deals with outlaws, boy. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Let's not waste each other's time pretending otherwise. Oh, government themselves ain't much more than a bunch of crooks. This is the land of opportunity, mister. And I'm giving you the opportunity to get your daughter back before 15 friends of mine take out all their anger and their loneliness on her. Where the hell is she? Where is she, boy? Bring Deke up to Tumbleweed in a couple hours. And don't get no funny ideas, or I will slit that horse throat myself. You boys have a pleasant afternoon. Yeah! Okay. Not who I thought it was. What do we do? We do as he says. You and me, Marshal. Mr. McFarland, I'll get you your daughter back. I owe her that. Please do. Poor guy. I'll teach you some respect for the law. Huh. <laughs> Hurry up, boy. Let's go. Quick as you can, deputy. Make sure he's tied on good. Stay with me, Marston. I won't let anything happen to her, sir. Yeah. Come on, let's ride hard to Tumbleweed. Come on. See, this right, is what happens when the Federals interfere in our affairs. Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. And I already told you, I ain't with the government. 
Now you say that, John, but the only thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here. They gave me no choice. That's your federal government, Mr. Johnson. They come down here dressed as cocky as the King of Diamonds, talking a lot of flannel about helping us, about spreading peace and civilization to the West, but they brought nothing but trouble and taxes. I agree with you. Wolves in cheap clothing, all of them. Rob you, then make you pay to have someone investigate the crime on your behalf. People around here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. The fellas I know don't care about people. All they care about is lining their pockets. Why is this sorry son of a bitch so important to them? Norman Deke, Williamson's right hand man. In other words, glorified oh. Harris. Hey, wait, Marshal! I'll be back for you! Bill's standards have slipped. We already filled you with lead once. The lovely bastard Excuse man me? who's mean enough to be second in command, but too cowardly and stupid to ever be a leader. Don't ever use that line near your deputies. You know, for his sake, they'd best not have laid a finger on Miss McFarland. What is this place we're headed? Doubleweed, a lonely godforsaken place. Some people say it's haunted. It was quite a town back in its day. It is 100% haunted. To Armadillo and went clean past Tumbleweed. That was that. Pretty soon, everybody had up to the left. Now it's just thieves, smugglers, and bandits. Scum like Deke here. Oh, popular spot for lynchings, too. Let's try to avoid that if we can, Marshal. Oh, my God. I just hope you're not taking advantage of the McFarland, Marston. It saved my life. It gave me food and bed when they had no idea who I was. I owe them more than I can ever repay. That's just they've been through a lot. Well, they're both vulnerable, different ways. I wouldn't have been running in and out of a burning barn to save their horses otherwise. I know you helped, just like you helped me. But you got your reasons for doing it. It's no secret why I'm here, Marshal. I told you the very first time I walked into your office. I trust you. It's just all this business with Blackwater and Williamson and the past. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard not to have doubts. I understand. I get it. I never planned to be in the lawman business neither. Um. How is this best? We stand by now. Been an outlaw to do the work of a lawman. That's madness. Ain't much difference between the two, as far as I can tell. There have to be rules, Marston. Even you must understand that. It's easy to make up rules, but they ain't much use if people don't understand why. True. Like my son. <laughs> if I tell him not to do something, he'll do it anyway, just to spite me. If I punish him. He resents me for it, but if I show him why it's wrong, at least he has reason not to do it again. That's nonsense. Without laws, we're nothing more than animals. Now look at Deke here. Go to hell! <laughs> Go to hell! Your boy steps out of line, you whack him. He does it again, whack him harder. No. A good man, Marshal, and I respect what you're trying to do. From what I've seen since I've arrived here, the law ain't really working. Criminals are like weeds, Marston. Wicks you stomp one out, another one sprouts up in its place. It's the nature of places. You know that as well as I do. It's like if you keep seeing a pattern, then have you tried Where doing something boys different? Know how to treat a lady. Ugh. Ugh. I hope to have a spotter yet. I ain't had my turn. My god, you belong in the and dirt. You're a man, do you? Here we are, here's Tumbleweed. Tumbleweed the all too familiar bridge. bridge. <laughs> yeah. This place is mighty creepy. Tumbleweed. Easy there. John. You'll be exchanging the prisoner for Bonnie in the middle of town. Keep your eyes open. I sincerely doubt these scum plan to play fair. <laughs> my ass. You bet. <laughs> Besides, Norm here is going to be my shield, ain't you, Norm? <laughs> It'd be my pleasure. <laughs> Lead Deke into town. We'll be right behind you. You got to walk behind you? I'm sure it's been nice for the boys to have a whore to play with. I hear those rancher girls like it in the rear. Stop talking about Bonnie like that. All right, start walking. The pump you full of lead. Son of a bitch! Why take it so damn long? Maybe she won't want to go home. She's been fucked so good. Come on now, boys! Cut me loose! No. Where's Bonnie? I thought we had a deal. Well, you thought wrong. We don't make deals with the law. 
Oh, you will regret this day. You want more? There you are. Let's go. Let's go get him. Gotta get the body before they kill her. I'm coming. I can't see it. Oh, no, 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 no. You can shake hands. Oh, what are you doing? <gasps> no! no, 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 I'm too late. No, I'm not too late. I can't be too late. I can't be too late. No, 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 no. Where is it? I can't alone. see. It's too freaking dark. Oh my God, get her down, get her down. We can deal with them later. Take care. All good now, son of Oh my god. This is insane. Oh. What are you doing? It's not exactly cover. Dumbass. Alright. Clearly are behind here. Let me get you out. Oh, hell, where are you going? Where are you think you're going? Where'd the rest of them go? Untie Bonnie? Oh, I will. <gasps> oh, that was horrifying. <gasps> Bonnie, are you okay? No. I'm fine now, Mr. Marston. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> what the hell took you so long? Stupid man. No, nope, she's fine. Exactly helping me. She'll be just fine. If you think I'm gonna lower myself by making a joke about being all tied up, you got another thing coming. <laughs> got another thing <coughs> coming. <sighs> I'm just glad she's okay. That was terrifying. <laughs> Please tell me I can still loot everybody. Yes. Look at all these bodies. Yes. Payday. All right, guys. I'm going to finish looting up here. And uh, I'll see you at the you next place. Good. Yeah. I need it more than you do. All right. I figured now that I have enough money, I can follow through on the Thieves Landing quest. I just want to play some Liar's Dice. Hello. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. Not really. Oh, whoa. Oh, there's two. Okay. What? <gasps> High stakes poker tournament? Woo! I got you. I got you. Where are you flipping going? What? This is craziness. I do see that. So sorry. I don't even know how I'm gonna cope with that. I, 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 uh, oh, oh, that is one bad mistake to make. I'd be screaming, running, and crying too. I, I don't even want to look at my work. Mm -mm. Nope, nope, didn't happen. Didn't, didn't happen. You didn't see anything. I don't even have words. There is no amount of payback or anything I can do to make what just happened right. Okay. Let's just take our mind off of that. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Welcome to Liar's Dice. Uh, each round requires a bet called an ante. Please choose if you wish to play or quit. Well, of course I want to play. In Liar's Dice, players bid on the total number of dice on the table. What? What the heck? I don't understand. To play Liar's Dice, take a look at your dice and enter a bid. What? Okay. Look around, look at your hey. dice. 
Okay, so we gotta... Oh, shoot. I gotta do freaking mental math. Ah, oh, shoot. Hold on, so is it like the total dice on the table? So we got... Oh, God. Uh, shoot. 9, 12, 13, 14, 15, 20, I think? Oh, gosh. I'm gonna do double check that and count again. 13... 18, 19, 20. Okay, so I think I have 20. Um... Marcy Johnson's been digging around here, so... You doing around here? You How high can you go? Yeah! Die fa well, I don't understand. What? I just know they're gonna be trouble. Ball. Am I- am I betting on how many I have? I'm leaving. I have I'm no- leaving. I have no clue. Or is it how many ones are on the table? Uh... Big or no oh, you can change the die phase. Oh, hey, hold up. I have no idea. I don't understand this yet. I don't. Let's go with th five threes. I have no idea. Sure. Hey, bad onions to me. Don't believe me, huh? The previous bit is too high. It can be called David out be as bull. Clean if he don't shut up. Howdy. <gasps> I don't understand. You know that old timer not shit himself again. When a bit is challenged, the dice are revealed and tallied. No. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. So I definitely lose. I ain't buried yet. <gasps> oh. I'm lying about how many I have. Well, how many I have and then how many they have as well to contribute to that. Okay. But how can you tell if they're bluffing or not? Okay. Oh, and then you lose a die. Okay, so I have two fives. So maybe someone else has a five? So let's try it. Okay. I'm going to say that there's... I know I have two. So I'm going to assume... Let's go with three. I don't know. My bed. She only with him for the money. That's the god honest You're truth. Something. Look at my eye. Hmm. The previous bit is a low. Is low. A player can enter another. That's a lie. That's a lie. This is a bluff. Only three fours. This is a die for bluffing. Okay. So wait. Should I ever fly? Oh. Oh, I see. I didn't catch what they were saying before. So they bid. Call out bluff. Uh, can I look again at what they said? I'm in a... There's like two fours. I don't know. I wish I could... I heard another train got raided like... Oh, enter a new bid or call out the bluff. Last bid was three twos. I see. I'm gonna call out bluff. <laughs> we got a joker here. Eh, 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 eh. Joker. Nope. Yep. Nothing. Ah, so he was lying. It was a bluff, only one. I thought you were a better liar. Okay, I think I get it now. But why would I ever want to lie about this? Where's your sin? Biz, there's one six. Good to see you. Last bit was one six. Declare bid spot on. The barkeeper huh. out here thinks that we can't taste the water he mixes with the whiskey. I'm gonna go Marcy with Johnson's been digging around two. Here some. I don't know. Subway? Think I'll make a bid. That's I got a six. I'm an honest man. Three threes. Mm. Okay. You look Four like fives? Push. There's no way. Absolutely no way. They barely have four die. Four dice. Call out bluff. That's way off, my friend. Good call. Hello. Howdy. Yeah. No. No way. Yeah. Exactly. There's no way. Ah, it's been a while. Yeah. Absolutely. Out, so are you trying to guess what they have? And then I, 
Not know Davy hides with the greases, I'll find him. I'm 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 kind of understanding, but not really. A liar or not? There's two threes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think okay, I think I kinda get it now. Two threes. Huh. This goes for the whole table. Wish I could look at the read the directions again. Or read the hints. Um so he bids that there's two I had definitely have a three. Those pepper dots just rub me wrong way. I'm gonna go with one three. Uh, or can I- I can bet different di- <gasps> you know that old time Wait a second, I have two fours. You tripping? Okay. I don't know. I don't know. I ain't no lie. Three twos. No. No twos. Okay. No twos. Yeah. Don't be such an old croaker. Oh, okay. That's what I like to see. I'm doing okay, I think. I have no idea. I haven't lost any more dice. It's that there's two twos. Two twos. No. I'm gonna go with two ones. Okay, I can't. So, so you can't bet lower than what the numerical bet was, is what I'm getting from this. Well, I don't have any sixes. So they could have the between them two they could have three sixes but I don't know each die got a one in six chance highly unlikely mm. I'm gonna call bluff no there's gonna be trouble I'm gonna call bluff oh hey, did I not do it can't be serious no if if they're right though I'm gonna be really upset oh see knew it knew it yeah. Ha! You're still in, partner. Sounds like bad onions to me. Maybe I can use mathematics to solve these. Okay. Last bid was two ones. Okay. Well, I have a one. I'm gonna say spot on. I ain't gonna argue with that. I know I got one. <gasps> Someone else has one. Oh wait, I think he also. Everyone has one. So there's three. Bid was dead wrong. Actually, three, three ones. Damn, that sucks. So you don't want to be wrong. I was close though. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Urgh, this is this is hard. I want to say that there's two fives. Let's say two fives. Let's go safe. Safe. Safety. Why are you sweating? Two six. Three ones. You're crazy. No, I don't have a one. They only got two die left or three die left per. Call bluff. You're bluffing. That's really high. Yeah, nothing. I got nothing. They got nothing. Yeah, already unlikely. Yeah, what the hell? Why would you? That is so unlikely. When you just think about probability alone. If you want three ones, you basically have to. I'm pretty sure you have to multiply one over six three times. That is such. That is so unlikely. Especially with so few die that we have. I see Davy's bones bleaching in the sun if he keeps taking Bones bleached. <laughs> Last bid was 1-3. Mm. Oh! I got two twos. Two you know twos. That old time and shit himself again? Enter you? bid. If that's the truth, I'm a Mexican mortician. You hear about that miracle tonic from the east? Like please no one have a two. Please no one have a two! Yeah! I won! Good Hot scene. damn, you got me. Yes! Uh, I like this game, kind of. I'm kind of understanding it, I think. I think it's making sense now. That's the truth. I'm an honest man. One three. I, don't I have one three. You. Two fours. I don't have a four, so... 
but they could potentially have a four. Or I'm gonna go with two twos. Two twos, because I know I have twos. If it is illegal, you may bid an increase. Okay. You may bid an increase in in the die face. Ah, I see. So what was the last one? Two fours. Did you hear about that dynamite explosion Two on that fours. Track? I'm gonna call again, I'm gonna call bluff. I, call I just bluff. don't think that's likely. Oh, I mean ah, You can never you can never tell. Yeah, only one. Bid was true at least two okay. Take my die. So now I'm back to being a little confused again. I mean, probability is probability. There's still a chance. Still a chance. One six. Enter initial bid. So how many? So if I have two Everybody dice left and I have three discarded, so the one, the guy next to me has two, and then the other guy probably only has one. So I'm gonna go with. There is one six on the board. My bid. I don't know. <laughs> Two twos. You're a wily one, all right. Okay, Lyle, that's all you. Call the bluff, all you want. So he's got Out. one two. I heard train got okay, he got it. Bid was true. Wow. <laughs> mm. Okay. Well, this guy's out. I think. Those paper Ooh. gods just rubbed me the wrong way. That's Spatchcock. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right, so it's just me and you. Yeah. All right. So we got, oh man, this is hard. I'm gonna go with one three. I don't know. I don't know. Cause that's what I have. Two threes? So he might trying to, he might try, he might be trying to make me believe that he has one. I'm gonna say spot on. I don't know. I don't know what he has, so it's potential that he- Oh! Hell yes! I was right! I was spot on! They up some <laughs> 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 so was caught with a spot on bid. <gasps> oh, so since I called him out for having a spot on bid, I won that. Bids there is one four. Another cold night ahead. Can I do... There's a one, two? I don't know. Okay, so I can only... Okay, so increased face, die. Um, well, I know I don't have a four. And he's betting a four. Oh, no. I think he maybe has a four, then. Spot on. I don't know. Sure. Why, why would he... Yes, I won. Thank you very much. Oh ma! <laughs> yes, I win. I win. Oh, I will take my winnings and GTFO. Oh, uh, I'm. I quit. Quit. I quit. Quit while you're ahead. Absolutely. Thank you, gentlemen. For your wonderful contribution to my bank account. That miracle turning makes your check. That was fun. I don't know if I had any of that right, but I won. So it doesn't matter now. This is the greatest day. And I think that might be high stakes poker. I think or no, is it? Is it high stakes poker? poker? I don't like Or there's Careful. Ooh. I knew that. Yeah, this might be like a high stakes poker game. Well, I gotta get dressed for the occasion for next time, but I also think I'm gonna save that for next time. You are looking at the newest Liar's Dice champion, and I am truly humbled to be walking away with 600 virtual doll hairs. Uh, if only the amount of money I made in games translated to real life, man, that would be awesome. Well, now that I know how to play, maybe I can get up some games myself. I...
don't actually know how any of that truly works. I was pretty much guessing the whole time. And then if I picked up subtle rules and whatever, I think I made a lot of mistakes. But once I thought I had stuff down, then I would go along with it. But obviously a lot of it has to do with probability. And as a former mathematics major myself, I know I'm crazy. Math does not play favorites. Math does not discriminate. It just is what it is. This day has been fantastic. I have recorded two amazing episodes in the same day. I had so much fun. So much hilarious stuff happened too. The story is starting to really, really get good. The stakes are getting higher and I cannot wait to play again soon. However, it is getting mighty hot in here. It's very immersive for the game because we're kind of riding around in a desert, but I would prefer to not feel like I am actually in a desert right now. If you guys enjoyed this video and if you're enjoying the playthrough so far, make sure to leave a thumbs up on the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell button so you do not miss all future uploads. Ah, this has just been so, so fun. This game has really really been refreshing in terms of games that I've been playing. It's so nice to be able to go back and play some older games because there really is something so charming and so much fun about the simplicity of some of these older games. Anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you guys in the next video.